I see the show had the same effect on you lol started to play through myself tonight. Does this count as post-conflict simulation? I'd say so. This is a sim. All right, let's get it started here. Game. Oh no, is it gonna show up? It was working earlier. Hello, Thomas. There we go. Took a little while. All right, folks, today we are going to start playing some Fallout New Vegas. We are going to start a new character, and we'll see how far we go. I am playing this on Twitch and on YouTube. I am streaming on my second YouTube channel. And we are going to, well, like I said, upload it on both and uh, see how far we get. I'm a big RPG player. And I've always wanted to kind of upload my RPG content, but this is kind of a test. Also, Fallout is very topical right now because of the TV show, obviously, that has come out. And uh, I have gotten the buck. I was playing a little bit of Fallout 2 last night. And now uh, we're hopping into New Vegas. Face cam will come on occasionally. Uh, I'll, I'll bring it on, uh, but we have an intro. We're going to show the intro, roll all that stuff. And... Um, yeah. Did I stream Fallout 2? No, I did not. But maybe I should. That could be a, quite a bit of fun. Um, anyway, the character build I'm going to do is like a uh, like an Italian mobster kind of guy. Um, it was either that or playing as a baseball player that just beats the shit out of people with a bat. But uh, I, think, uh, I think a cracked out Italian mobster drug addict type of character would be kind of fun yeah i played fallout one um not too long ago so but again not on stream i probably should have streamed it but i was just playing it uh by myself and in, in some off time are you streaming from twitch too carol yes i am i am on i'm streaming on twitch and youtube youtube on my second channel wolfpack six seven eight and then on Twitch, it's Wolfpack345 Live. Uh, yeah, so I'm thinking the guy, my character, I kind of want him to run around with just a pistol, probably like a 1911. Uh, a Gucci one, but a 1911. And then maybe we'll, we'll do a Tommy gun or something. Um, and you know, whenever he's in a civilized place, he'll just beat people to death with his fists. All right, new game. Yes, and... I will go away now.
changes. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover. Well, shit. <laughs> the sound seemed low. Fuck. My bad. Uh, should we restart at this time of commentary? We need the Lord Dump. We need the Lord Dump. I can't. I fucked that up. I'm sorry, gamers. Um, hopefully it's a little better this time. Also. <laughs> oh my gosh. What was I doing? I was doing something very important. Gameplay. No, it's not going to be in gameplay. Uh, display? Dial general subtitles. We'll turn those on. Okay. Alright, new game. What brings you to this game, Wolf? I don't know. You know, I'm a big fan of it. That's all. Alright. We will do the intro. Minimal commentary, but, uh... I'll try a little bit. Think a Fallout series would be extremely successful on my channel? See, that's where I'm like, I feel like if I deviate from my simulation, I guess focus, it wouldn't do too well. That's what, kind of why I started the second channel and just haven't done much with it. But yeah, I, I love RPGs. I'm a big RPG gamer and whenever I'm just, you know, it's either Sims or RPGs. You can kind of tell by the kind of content I upload. <laughs> oh my, this game's kind of violent. fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. 
a vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business, under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier, hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink. Dig? That's a respectable suit you Maybe got on, sir. Delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling, must seem like an 18-carat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. Um, no, yeah, I think I could definitely make an RPG series really good, but... That's why I just stream them. Now the game's really loud. Now we get the DLC dump. Let me tab out and just turn it down just a smidge. There we go. All right. Very immersive beginning. Okay, that's one of the mods I'm using. You're awake. How about that? Whoa, easy there. Uh, settings, audio, voices. That's what we want to be louder. The music's kind of loud. I don't care about that. Yeah, get the voices up. Easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? Hmm, what should his name be? Chris? No, no, no. Okay. Uh, Rick. Go on with the classic. That's a good Italian name. Rick. Montesanti. Montesanti. Yes. Cornelia. Yeah, that's a good Can't one, too. What I'd have picked for you, but if that's hey, why wouldn't you have name, picked that, you old man? Doc Mitchell. Welcome to Good Springs. Now, Doc I Mitchell. Mind, I don't like that name. Go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How'd I do? Oh my God! You did horrible. I look hideous. Ooh, I kind of like that. I like the hair. He looks like a, a greaser. Dark brown. Uh, okay. I don't, I don't want the facial hair though. Facial hair. 
gunslinger. This is all hideous. Ladies man, that's a ladies man? Wow, okay. Tough guy. Okay, we'll go we'll go with that. Why not? It's not like the character models are Yeah, this will be Rick. Well, I got most of it right anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's Let me know if the volume's okay. On your feet. Oh. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. You're Take very close to me. Now. It ain't a race. Okay. What you got lying around here? Pencil? I'll take that. Don't mind if I do. Some sunset spasparilla. You don't mind if I drink one of these, do you? Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of parched. But okay, I'll make my way over to this machine. Looking good so far. Why, thank you. Go ahead and give the bigger tester a try. We'll learn right quick if you get back all your faculties. I, 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 are you sure about these? You know, where I'm from, these are scams, but. Up in Josie. Uh, okay, strength. We can, uh, we can do all of this at the end in a uh, more effective menu. Perception. Endurance. We all know the special skills. Charisma. <laughs> Cretan. Uh, okay. All right, so we have five points here. We're gonna, we're gonna knock intelligence down. He's not gonna be very smart. Charisma will be lucky. Lucky, charismatic, and stupid. I gotta work on my like, my Italian accent though. Hey, I'm walking here. You know, that's, that's the kind of guy I'm going for. Uh, normally I play very cowboy-esque ca characters, like gunslinger types in this game, but I wanted to try something different. Endurance. Oh my god, he's gonna be really freaking dumb, though. We'll, we'll do one more in intelligence. Then one in strength, how about that? Uh, you know what? Yeah, I mean, I don't really want to go... You know what? I will go really dumb. Let's let's get that strength up. Because I do plan on doing some unarmed combat. And if we're doing unarmed strength, that is pretty important. Yeah, that's a pretty standard score. Standard there. score. After what you've been through, I'd say that's great. Thank news. you. I appreciate well, it. Well, I don't know if that's good. necessarily a compliment. Laser pistol. Yo, you Doc, you're packing you heat over here? And we go through a couple of questions. I just want to grab this real quick. Oh, hope you don't mind. Once again, I know it's, you know. Yeah, I don't know what you were doing up there in my head. So uh, it's the least, you know, this is my fee. All right, Doc. What do you want from me? All right. I'm gonna say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. Dog. Cat, maybe? Mm-mm. Yeah, cat. House. You know, a house, that's a good investment. Night. Mm. Treasure. Bandit. Crush. Light. Uh, flash. Mother. Non-existent. Human <laughs> shield. Um. Yeah, we'll go jeans. Okay. 
Now, hey, I my Italian the mama's got good I want jeans. You to tell me how much they sound like something you'd say. First one, conflict just ain't in my nature. Well, it's not in my nature, but uh, you know, I've had to learn. I've had to sharpen my edge. I'm gonna disagree. I ain't given to relying on others for support. I got a strong bond. I'm gonna disagree with that. I'm always fixing to be the center of attention. Uh, no opinion. I'm slow to embrace new ideas. No opinion. <laughs> I charge in to deal with my problems head on. Uh, not necessarily. Disagree. Almost done here. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. Hmm. Hmm. Angry two-headed ant. You know what? I can see it. Okay. How about this one? Uh, see a priceless work of art. Yeah, yeah baby. One. My guy's all about them investments. Head on a pillow. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. See if it all seems right. My second YouTube channel is Wolfpack678. Barter. Okay, I like barter being up there. And I'm not and I unarmed. Okay, we'll take unarmed and speech. How about that? Yeah, we'll take that. Hmm. Maybe I do want small guns. 10 millimeter. Yeah. Uh, you know what? We'll go unarmed though. Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from you. I got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical My history. My medical history. Just a formality. Ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. How would you know? <laughs> Actually, that big lake over there near Vegas, uh, I got some ancestors hanging out there at the bottom. Um let's see. Early bird. Hmm. Your melee. More damage, but less critical hits. Yeah, why not? We'll do that. Oh my gosh. Logan's loophole. No one's going to put you out to pasture because you're going to stay young and level 30 forever. You'll never again become addicted to Kim's and they'll last twice as long. But after 30, you can kiss experience, perks, and skills goodbye. I kind of like that. I kind of like that. Yeah, let's do that. All right, I guess that about does it. Thanks, Come Doc. Me. I'll see you out. All right, well, let me... Oh, got any pants for me? I'll take this baseball. Don't mind if I do. What build or theme am I going for? I'm going for, you know, an Italian mobster kind of guy. Uh, he's primarily going to use a pistol and his fist. Um, one thing I want to do is change this, so... There we go. Destroyed books. Doc, do you, you were the guy digging in my brain and you don't even know how to read? You just have a bunch of burnt books over here, bud? My guy is heavily inspired by Christopher from The Sopranos. <laughs> That's kind of kind of dumb, but you know. Oh, what's that? Broken. Broken gun. Here, these are yours. Was all you had on you when you was brought in. All right, well, thank I hope you. I don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find a next of kin, but it was just something about a platinum chip. Well, if you're heading back out there, you ought to have this. They call it a pip boy. A pip I grew up in one of them vaults uh, who made before the war. We all got one. Ain't much use to be now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. 
I know what it's like having something taken from you. And put this on, too, so the locals don't pick on you for lacking modesty. Never was much my style, anyway. Hey, I appreciate your hospitality, Doc. Thanks for patching me up. Uh, don't mention it. It's what I'm here for. You should talk to Sunny Smiles before you Sunny leave Sunny Smiles? She what can kind? help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. What kind of name is that? She'll likely be at the saloon. Oh. Wow. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out, too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your Pistols, grave. fists, gabagool. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But try not to get killed anymore. All right, sure thing, Doc. Uh, yeah, we want to play in hardcore mode. Hey, Doc, you mind if I grab this hat? Thank you. All right. Let's go, items. What do we got? Nine millimeter pistol. I like that. Throwing spear. I'm going to disregard that. I don't want that. Shotgun. Grenade rifle. I'll probably just sell that. What's this 9mm pistol? Can I not whip it out in here? Let's get out. Let's go outside. Oh my. It's bright. Got a fragment that signals on your pit boy coded transmission of some sort of sad, jazzy undercurrent that makes your head hurt. As far as you can tell, it appears to be an, investi an invitation to the midnight science fiction feature in the Mojave, Mojave Drive-In. Please, please arrive early to catch the trailers. Old Wolf Blues has been loaded. Your pit boy. Maybe I should have my guy have like a uh, mid-Atlantic accent, you know? I don't know. Lonesome Road has been loaded. The problem is I suck with accents, but my uh, my old-timey radio voice ain't that bad. My Italian one is frankly offensive. Um, all right. Here's my pistol. A nine mil. I like it. It says nine millimeter, but it looks like a 1911. What do I know, though? No, I put that away. Dead money has been loaded. Oh, sorry. Didn't realize there was one on the chamber, fellas. Let me just, uh... Let me just put that away. There we go. Doc said I should go see e. Sunny Smiles in the saloon. Data. Okay, local map. Quest. Sierra Madre Grand Opening. Back in the saddle. All right, we'll go talk to. Go talk to Sunny Smiles. Nice looking. Quaint town here. General store. Let's let's hop into the general store. I have a few things to sell. I was gonna go rummaging through your trash. Oh my! Let me grab this and I'm a little thrifty. I'm gonna sell that to him too. This guy's getting swindled. What a fool! What's up, fella? What's up, big you guy? Be the one Doc Mitchell was patching up. Way yeah, that's I me, it, I Chet. I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office. I've got plenty of supplies for sale. Even got some weapon mods and special ammo. Well worth the caps if you ask me. Yeah, if yeah, you're yeah. hurting for caps, I've also got boxes of surplus ammo in the miscellaneous section. They're not great, but you get what you pay for. Oh, I appreciate it. Why is your surplus ammo not good? That's a good question. What's it's wrong with it? It's all about quantity over quality. Trouble is, you'll be cleaning and fixing your gun a lot more than usual when you use those kind of bullets. Uh, do you know anything about the fellers that attacked me? The leader was a new Vegas type. Mm. Typical city boy. Mm -hmm. He had a bunch of great cons with him, probably hired guns. The great cons normally stay in their own territory way up northwest, on account of them being enemies with the NCR. Anything else you can tell me about They're this, guys? Sons of bitches. Mean, but not crazy. Sure. They'll leave you alone unless you got something they want. The great cons deal in illegal chems. There's a good chance that most chems you come across were made by great cons. Hmm. What do you got for Can sale? Do. All right. 
What do I got that I don't want? That. Get rid of that. You have my baseball. I'll keep those binoculars. You can have this venom. Bobby pins. Okay. Boxing gloves. Hmm. Sell that metal armor. Sell the freaking grenade rifle. I'm never going to use that. Shotgun. Uh. I'll sell that too. Armor. Weapon repair kits. Okay. And we have this 10 millimeter pistol. I'm going to keep that for the time being. What What do you got here, big guy? Painter. Hmm. Monica gumdrops. Okay. You know what? We'll just, we'll just roll with that. Oh, here. You can have my grenades. I have 50 rounds. 15 rounds of 9 millimeter ammunition. All right. Another All right. satisfied customer. Take it easy now. Yeah, see you later, buddy. Let me, uh, let me see what else I got. Apparel, let me, okay. Let me put on the hat. There we go. Yeah, I'm, I'm digging it. All right, get me out of here. I'm gonna go talk to Sonny who what. Some motorcycles. Uh, hello? Easy Pete. Got anything to say? Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? Why are you called Easy Pete? Should maybe get a job. Was a prospector until I decided to settle here to get away from the NCR. Get away from the NCR. Okay. No, we'll just take it easy and help out with the Brahmin and Bighorners. Okay, okay. What's wrong with the NCR? Don't get me wrong. The NCR's got a lot of decent folk in it. It's just that they make you part of them whether you like it or not. Towns like Good Springs and Prim don't stay independent for long. Not if you've got something the NCR wants. Mm -hmm. Still, the NCR keeps the Legion away. What do you use Bighorners for? Meat and hide, mostly. Can't put a pack on them. They just lay down until you take it off. Can find a bunch of wild ones high up in the hills. Okay. But gotta be careful around them. They can put up a decent fight if cornered. All right. Uh, know anything about the uh, fellas that attack you? The one me? in the fancy suit seemed to be calling the shots. Mm. That's as much fancy as I know. Fancy suit. Other folks in town might know more. Word of advice, though, if you ever catch up with him, watch out. The man's got cold eyes like a snake. Can't be trusted, I'd say. Well, I'm gonna shoot him in the head, so. Keep your gun handy if you go poking around some of the abandoned places around here, like the schoolhouse. Critters move in there sometimes. Okay. Good Springs education system is thriving, I see. All right. Oh, dog. Cheyenne, stay. Don't worry. She won't bite unless I tell her to. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if I believe that. Uh, um... I, Doc Mitch yeah, said you could teach me, but I don't really... I I don't really Sounds need like to. you need all the help you can get after what, what? they done to you. Meet me outside well, behind the saloon. Okay. Do you have any booze? Vixen things. I just want to read it. It's karma. Okay. I guess uh, that fixing thing saying, I thought I could read it, but. Hmm. Hello. If you're looking for supplies, Chet over at the general store can help you out. What kind of lousy bar is this? Where's the bartender? I just pour my own drink. 
You're gonna get mad at me if I do that, don't you? Alright, fine. Let me... You can just walk out here. Hello, lady. Now, see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there? Take this and try to hit a couple of them. More of a pistol man. There's an aid. <laughs> I think I just dropped it. I said take this. Varmint rifle, okay. I do have it. All right, uh, you know, I'm a, I'm a pretty good shot. You ready? Are you looking? Okay, all right, get ready, watch this. Uh, okay. Uh, okay, I know I'm... Oh my gosh. <laughs> what are these bottles, lady? Everything all right? No! Until next time. That's the oh! Right. Look down the site. Look down the site. <laughs> I was looking down the site and I missed five times. Uh. Um. Uh. <laughs> Sorry, the the bullet in the head is really affecting things. Oh my. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help your aim. Nice shot. Thank you. Thank well, you. No, I'm a natural. You came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Tell you what, I gotta go chase geckos away from our water supply anyway. Darn critters are attracted to it. Why don't you come along? Uh, I think I've learned enough. Suit yourself. Hope this helped you some. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss anything good on the jukebox. Cheyenne would never forgive me. Uh, hey, do me a favor. Trudy? She's the bartender up at the Prospector. Oh, well, she Can't wasn't there when I was looking for a drink. She likes to meet newcomers. She'd be cross with me if I didn't ask you to poke your head in and say hi. Uh, see you later, hound. All right. Data quest. Go meet Trudy at the Prospector Saloon. Okay, well, I can do that. I can do that. This is an ammo bench. Yeah. Okay. I mean, she wasn't in there when I was asking for a drink. Right, Easy Pete? Did she just show up? It is almost like Red Dead. Being nice. If you don't hand Ringo over soon, I'm going to get my friends. Hey, Ringo Star? To the ground. Got it. We'll keep it. Gun metal. Old hey, white wolf, wolf, wolf gun, gun to your head, head, head. which is Come the better cowboy, cowboy game, game. RDR2 on New, New Vegas. Vegas. Oh no. I don't know what happened. Why is the alert box saying so up? Yeah. Uh. Alright. Gun to your head. What's a better cowboy game? Red Dead 2 or New Vegas? Dude, I'm going New Vegas. <laughs> Red Dead 2. I do need to play the prologue, though. All right. What's that you said about Ringo? Some trader who decided he'd rather shoot than pay the toll for being in our territory. Thanks for the sub, by He's the way. Somewhere in town. Would serve these idiots right if me and my guys shot the place up after we got payback on Ringo. I mean, I, I can understand wanting your money. What, what area is your territory? It is now. Me and the rest of the guys busted out of the NCR prison east of here and took over. Now we're calling the shots. What are you in prison for, big guy? None of your damn business. You ought to know better than to ask a man that kind of question. I just need to know if I should watch my step around you. You know, if you're in for manslaughter, that's kind of worrisome. But if you're like, I don't know, you're not paying your taxes. Rob some people, burn some things killed a few guys okay really good guy really good guy okay what's going on in the rest of the same place? old shit that's been going on for years the ncr and legion is still fighting over hoover dam for some reason 
Okay. Goodbye. Yeah. Uh, one sec though. One sec. I got something for you. I got something for you, buddy. Oh, come here. Hey. God damn it. Hope you didn't mind. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I agree with you, Easy Pete. That's a that's a situation where you say yep. That's right, bitch. Ooh. Um. Put <laughs> those cases. Yep. Howdy. I hope you didn't just bring a heap of trouble down on Good Springs by killing Joe Cobb like that. His friends might come looking for him, and I don't think they're gonna care who was involved in his death or not. Well, what's done is done. So, uh, I what didn't, can I do for you? I didn't like the way he was talking to me. That guy looked mad. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Looks like our little town got itself dragged in the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About a week ago, this traitor, Ringo, comes into town. Mm -hmm, survivor mm -hmm. of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. We figured he was just in shock. So we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. It's odd that Cobb wasn't able to find Ringo. He didn't really look around. I mean, I didn't give him much of a chance because of his negative attitude. I didn't like his vibes. Cobb hasn't exactly been looking for Ringo too hard. I think he's afraid that Ringo will ambush him. Well, he's dead now, true. so he was afraid, but... Um, what are you going to do now? Some of the others, like Sonny, will probably stand up for Ringo if he asks for help, which he hasn't. Personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes the powder gangers with him. Where, where is he? He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the oh, hill. I'll go, I'll go take a gander. All right. Can I get a drink, though? Uh, what do I, what do you got for sale? I'm sure I've got something you like. Thank you. God, what's a man got to do to get a beer? Um, I'll take a modest amount. I'll take four. Thank you. Appreciate it. Pleasure doing business with you. Goodbye. Be careful out there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Appreciate the beers, Trudy. I'm gonna go talk to that Ringo character. Yeah, so, sorry for disturbing your morning, Easy Pete. Here, let me. I thought I could drag this guy. I guess you can't drag bodies and stuff in this game. Is that only like Skyrim and later games? The UI, I'm really, it's really taking me a while to get used to this again. Okay. Yeah, Rick has a, has a temper. Doesn't like being disrespected. You don't disrespect the family. Where is that dumb robot? Let me just come out here. Hmm. That's close enough. Hey, Who buddy. And what do you want with me? You're gonna shoot me, you better not miss like the other chuckle fuck that shot me in the head. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard, that's all. We got off to a bad start. What say we start over with a friendly game of caravan? You know how to play? Mmm. 
A name to let's skip the let's skip the hoopla. You're you're here in hiding and you want to play a game, Ringo. A man named Joe Cobb was looking for you. I, I shot him in the head, mainly because uh, of his thanks, attitude. Thanks, I but. guess. Cobb wasn't the problem though. I could have handled him if he ever found me. Well, it was Cobb's really hard. Friends are the bigger problem, and when he doesn't get back, they'll be coming here for blood. There's no way I can fight them all. Oh, good luck. Why are the powder gangers out to get My you? My caravan was on the return trip from California and heading back to the company branch in New Vegas when we got jumped. Not even a drop your weapons and hands up before the bullets mm. started flying. We put up a good fight, but there was too many of them. I took a few of the bandits down before I ran, so I figure their friends are out for revenge. Uh, what are you going to do about them? I'm going to lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang. Uh, uh, let's do it together. Need a hired gun? I'm available. All I've got left on me are a handful of caps. But you I'll get me this. out of this, and I'll make sure the Crimson Caravan pays you back. You've got my word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll have it. Yeah, we we'll just do it. end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board. Yeah, I'll ask around. Uh, start easy with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. Okay. All right. All right. I was about to say, Easy Pete's kind of, I don't know, he's got a bloodlust. I'll take the Sunset Sarsaparilla. Yo, let's go. I uh, don't mind if I do. I love a good drink. What do you, what do you say, Ringo? You like drinking? All right, we'll go, we'll go discuss matters with Sunny Smiles. That's her real name. Kind of sounds like some sort of alias to me. I love the new decor, Pete. It's looking good. Oh, where is she? Oh. Howdy, Sonny. I don't think Joe Cobb knew what hit him. I'm hoping you took him down for a good reason and not for fun. No, I didn't like the way he talked to me. What do you gosh? I'm not some crazy murdering freak. He just, I don't know, he gave me an attitude. Say no more. I'm in. Uh, well, that was easy. Even though Joe Cobb's dead, his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, mm -hmm. some of the folks in town might decide to mm -hmm. help out as well. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere, and Chet just got a shipment I of guess, other armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. I guess Finally, Easy Pete would a have a lot of dynamite. We'll end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. All right. Um, any ideas on how we convince Trudy? A silver tongue would help. Oh. Convincing Trudy that we had a good plan I mean, to win the fight would also help. My guy has like three intelligence, but he is charismatic. Don't don't say silver tongue again though. I don't like that. Um Okay, goodbye. I'll be waiting. Yeah, I don't I understand the assignment just fine. So you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang. It's a big risk, but I suppose you have to do what you think is right. Oh, you could help me take out the powder gangers. Bullets, explosions? That's a fun. I was planning on sitting this one out. Oh, but really? For some reason, I can't help but like you. I'm with you. Oh, Let me have a word with a few other folks, and I'll see if I can't round up some more members for this militia you're creating. While everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. Uh, considering the, the condition of this here bar... I feel like there's a lot of violence here. There's way more violence in this raggedy town than you guys are letting on. That's all I'm saying. Who was that man you were arguing with? That's a dumb question. I shot him in the forehead. Uh, goodbye. Be careful out there. Santos, you say something like that again, and I'm going to shoot Sunny Smiles in the head. Just for you. Barbaric. Uh, but while I'm in here... 
Feeling thirsty? Yeah, what do you got for sale? I'm sure I've got something you like. Um... Scotch. I'll just take one, thank you. You know, I'm at, when, in, when in Rome, you know? <laughs> We're in the bar, might as well just grab Thanks. that. Goodbye. Be careful out there. Let's see. Good drink. All right, let me go talk to Easy Pete. Howdy. I know you just saw me shoot that man in the head, in the head, but and I know it's mighty gruesome. So I have a proposition for you. You seem very unfazed by that. So I don't want to use your dynamite to blow people up. Too dangerous. Gonna kill all yourselves if I let you touch it. Better to leave it buried. Safer that way. How hard can it be? You just <laughs> lighted and throw, big guy. Too dangerous. Sorry. Blow yourself up. Blow your neighbor. Oh. Uh, Blow the whole town up. I hear you've got dynamite. It would help. To oh my gosh. Get, get yep. out of here. Yup. You know what? Where's your dynamite? I'm gonna go find your dynamite, buddy. I'm gonna use it anyway. Hello. You looking to buy some supplies? No. Need your supplies to fight the powder now gangers. Just hold on. I never voted to take on the powder gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking uh, about. Uh, I don't know about that. Let them take over the town then. I'm sure business will be booming, buddy. You made your point. I can provide people with some leather armor and extra ammo. Sure hope it's worth it. And uh, I'll be guarding the store while all this is going on. I have to put my business first. You understand. You're pathetic. Take it easy now. But hey, I understand. Okay, barter. Let's get guns up. 25. I hate random numbers like 12, 15. All right, there we go. Choose one perk. Combat, you do 10 plus damage against female opponents. Intense training. Mm. In combat, you do 10 plus damage against male opponents outside of combat. You'll sometimes have access to unique dialogue options when dealing with the same sex. Hmm. I'll go Lady Killer. Because uh, that kind of fits the character. Mark can just hold off. Yeah, we'll do Lady Killer. Done. Okay. Mainly for the extra dialogue options, not necessarily the murdering part. <clears throat> oh, Pete, that was a loud cough. You doing okay there? Right, let me go. Uh, let me go talk to Doc. Oh, this is the, the little thing that saved me. Howdy, partner. Ugh. Might I say I, you're looking fit as a fiddle? I really don't like you, but uh, thanks for digging me out of the grave. Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. Okay, buddy. Who are those men that attacked me? Can't say me? that I'm familiar with the rascals. Some of the fine folks in town might be able to help you out with that. Are you decent in a fight? Trouble with rustlers, huh? Count me in, partner. Those varmints will be running home with their tails between their legs. Yeah, when they see you rolling in, I'm sure. I've never seen a robot like you I'm before. I'm a Securitron. Robco Security Model 2060B. If you ever see any of my brothers, tell them Victor says howdy. Okay. Goodbye. Happy trails. Yeah. See you later, bud. Hey, Doc, I'm back. Got anything else in here? Don't mind if I look around. Where are you? What are you doing? Where have you run off to, Doc? Oh, having a dinner. You live here by yourself? Got 
four chairs, big table. I wonder how much cooking you get up to in here. Probably not a whole lot now. Welcome back. I have to loom over you. Come see me again so soon. What can I do for you? I need you to take this gun, Doc. Uh, no. Town's going to uh, be attacked by bandits. You want to help? Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Oh, uh, this was not caused by me. My bum leg and my supplies are scarce, but I'll give you what I can spare. See you later, Dr. Derper. You take care now. All right. Ew, I just drank out of the toilet. I did. <laughs> Sorry, Doc. I thought that was your sink. I'll see you later, buddy. Okay. Easy Pete is uh, a no-go, unfortunately, with all of his dynamite. Unless you know, find out where it's buried. Oh, you know, where, where's the easy Pete? Where's the Pete residence? That's what I want to know. I, you know, knowing someone like Easy Pete, he didn't walk too far to to bury the those goods. Let me just wander around, like up on that hill. Let's investigate this. Good Spring Cemetery. Need a shovel. I don't want to go digging up graves, but I'm sure this is where Easy Pete has buried. What is this? J. Frenzel. Benny. Hmm. wonder if we got one. That Keep out over here oh look at all those scorpions down there I'm I'm fine hmm that's Vegas though wow beautiful I'm honestly not sure where Pete hides his dynamite. I'm guessing it's up here though. I don't have a shovel. There's not a shovel around. It's Good Spring Snow Globe. A limited edition of Mojave Landmark Snow Globe. Pre-war artifacts widely considered to be useless. Rumor has it some collectors will pay dearly for them. Okay. All right, well, was this where I was buried? I wonder. Okay, well, easy Pete, you know, I'm sure he'll still uh, be slinging his gun. Just, we won't be chunking dynamite left, right, and center, which is a right shame. Uh, that's probably a good thing. Chances are I would blow my hand off with the uh, sticks of dynamite. Hello. Who are you? Howdy. Okay. Good chat. All right, up to the gas station we go. You know, I do want to check out, is this the school? Oh, that's Doc Mitchell's house, I knew that. Let's check out that school. Yeah, right here. They did mention about something being in here. Let's see if there's anything that can help us in this fight. Oh, some creepy crawlies. 
Oh boy, there's a lot of them. Yes, I'm gonna use bats here. Head. There we go. Ugh. They're so small. Put the gun away. There we go. Oh, go! I'll use my, I'll use my bare hands. I don't want their legs. Torta, Nastray. Terminal. Can't open that. Can't open that. That's a right shame. Take these bobby pounds. Oh, not a whole lot in here. That leads out. Good springs. Okay. Well, it was it was worth taking a look. If there's anything good, but whatever's in that safe is what's good. Fortunately, I lack the skills to be able to unlock it. All right, let's go talk to um, Ringo. All right, Ringo. How are you, bud? Howdy. Okay, that was kind of rude. I just walked so in. So what's going on? Did Sunny agree to help us? Sure did. She's with us. Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Unless you think there's something else you can do. No, let's do it. All right, I'm ready. I hope. Time to look alive. The powder. Uh, that's convenient timing. I must admit. How many are there? At least six. They look pretty mean. Yeah. I'll be set up near the store. I'm dealing with Let's lots of mean fellas. To make it that far. All right, goodbye. Let's go. Uh, for this, I'll use uh, I'll use the guy's gun, the big honcho's gun. Let's see. Maybe we can talk it out. It's all one big misunderstanding, guys. Let's try to chat. Okay, no chatting. Okay. You know, I tried. Come on. Trudy. Oh, God. Trudy just got. Oh, no. Did Trudy just die? Oh gosh, we're out of ammo. Maybe Trudy's just passed out, you know? Get away from that dog! No. Damn. No. Come on. Goodbye. Oh no, Cheyenne! Sonny, your dog! I owe you a huge favor Dude. for this. Here, these are technically Crimson Caravan funds, but yeah, I know they'll understand once I explain things. Seems a little light, but... <sighs> Dang, here I'll stick gone. around for a bit longer, but I'll be gone in a few days. If you ever visit New Vegas, look me up at the Crimson Caravan camp. I'm sorry, Cheyenne. 
Trudy. I'm sorry, Trudy. Dynamite. Can't believe. I wonder if Sonny's gonna be a little upset. Where where the heck's easy Pete? Hopefully no one else got murdered here. I'll take that baseball bat. what you did hello that'll teach the powder gangs to avoid good springs in well, the you future. seem in good spirits but that's okay I need to get the prim. Sure can take the road southeast out of town till it hits the freeway prim is the town with a roller coaster straight south can't miss okay. it right. NCR patrols do a good job of keeping the highway clear but I'd keep your gun where you can reach it easily you never know who you'll run into. Off the road, you'll probably start running into hostile wildlife. My advice would be to stick to the highway when you can. All right. Until thanks. next time. Actually, do you- Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? Uh, maybe. Do uh, you have any work? Not in Good Springs, no. But if you're up for a little scavenging, there's always the schoolhouse. Hey, I was just there. Most of what's in there is junk, but there's this old safe that even Easy Pete wasn't able to crack with dynamite. If you want to take a shot at it, I just, I already looked, unfortunately. Any magazines? The lock's too much for you to handle. Reading through the magazine might give you the edge you need. Oh. All right. Always happy to help someone down on their luck. Goodbye. Until next time. I am going back to that safe. Hey. Hey, Pete. That ought to keep things settled for a while. Hope it stays that way. Yeah, I agree. All right, later. Keep your gun handy if you go poking. I was just there. The no, abandoned I... places around here, like the schoolhouse. <sighs> yeah. Wasteland critters like yeah. to move in when sun is not looking, so watch out. All right. Well. All right. We'll check out that schoolhouse and then head down to the prim. Good old town of prim. Crack open the safe. Where is it? Let's see. Aid. Magazine. Beautiful. Oh no. There we go. Bottle caps. Knife, I'll take that. Stem pack, tire iron. Alright. Good. Alright, let's get out of here. Um, I am curious though, stats. Am I hungry? I am a little hungry. Okay. Items. Let's see. Drink a beer. Sleep minus three four. Yeah, we need to sleep and stuff because we're playing in the. Uh, that makes us. Cactus fruit. There we go. All right, let's get out of here. All right, off to Prim we go. Data. Quests. Track down the source. No, no, no. Reunion. Off in this direction, I suppose. Okay, we can do that. Alright. Off into the wasteland we wander. Let me uh, get my gun out. Single shotgun. 
That seems serviceable. Starting to wear off. Oh, let's get back on. Let's get on the road. So we can avoid any nonsense, any hoopla. There's the roller coaster. It must be Prim. Vegas is the other way. Little shack up here. Gene skydiving. What's in here? Radio. Nothing here. Okay. Fascinating. Couple of busted up houses here. Some people. Are these powder gangers? Sure are. Please reload. Goodbye. Oh God, my leg. All right, let's uh, let's work on our, let's heal ourselves. Stem pack. My goodness. Okay, so there's mines in the area. Uh. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? I didn't even see that. patrols out here lately which means not much loot our crew is thinking we should make a move soon follow up the tracks up north okay well let me take your stuff stem pack any more mines Freaks just have a bunch of mines laying around. Weirdos. Can't believe this is stealing. These guys are. They're baddies. Alright. Um. I don't really want to go through that muck either. Let me just head back out the way I came. I don't see a mine. Can't really run now because my leg is really hurt. We'll see. Maybe someone in Prim can patch me up. We save. There's something running around up in front of us. It's a little, little monster. I'm just gonna avoid that. I guess it's a gecko. Taking some radiation here.
Looks like it's ignoring me. Which is good. Not too interested in whatever in those things uh, coming after me. Alright. Slowly walking to print. Hobbling. With my bloody stump of a leg. There's a person. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Uh, it's a brim. Um, what's going on in Prim? Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is oh my dead God. Is these same hiding. goobers? What's more, there are two tribes of raiders causing trouble in this area as well. You'd be safer heading back up to Good Springs. Oh, it's just there. Shouldn't you be protecting the sound, the uh, town, buddy? They don't fall under NCR jurisdiction. Even if they did, we're in no shape to protect them. Why can't you protect we them? We don't have the equipment to take out the convicts. And even if we did, we need some extra hands for backup. You should talk to Lieutenant Hayes. <sighs> He's in a tent down the road. Just stay on the west side of the overpass if you don't want to get shot. Okay. Uh, copy that. You can do that. You just come through here. A guard tower. We need to find a doctor. That's what we need to find. Oh, look at that. First aid kit. Come here. Water. Empty syringe. Okay, a whole lot of nothing. Let's go into this house and see. Maybe there's something. Hmm, doesn't look like it. Yeah. Find a doctor's bag or find a doctor. I'd love to. I don't want to steal from the NCR, really. Okay, we'll head down. I'm hey. Sergeant McGee of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. You want to talk about something? Speak to Lieutenant Hayes. Okay. Where are you from, bud? I'm from the Hub originally, but it's been oh, a long time the Hub. Since I saw it. I'm on my second tour here. Most non-commissioned officers are. All right. Goodbye, sir. Lieutenant Hayes tent. That's where I need to go. Let's open the metal door to the NCR tent. Guy's got uh, no medical supplies. Evening. Oh, hello. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, Fifth Battalion, First Company. What's your business? What are you doing here? We were sent out here to hold back the tide of convicts from the correctional facility. As you can probably mm -hmm. tell, we aren't doing the kind of job we could be doing. It looks real effective. What's the problem with your mission? mission? isn't a problem. The problem is with supplies. The convicts are better armed and organized than our intel initially suggested. I'm trying to get some reinforcements here, maybe some guns with some firepower, but shit. Things are just going slow. Classic. Uh, tell me about this correctional facility. Most people just call it NCRCF. That's NCR Correctional Facility. Okay. A little bit ago, the convicts there staged a coup. Killed the guards that weren't able to escape. And have been ransacking the area since then. Hmm. Any information on them? They've taken to calling themselves powder gangers. Mostly because they've taken to using the explosives meant to clear boulders as weapons. Hmm. They got organized faster than I would have thought. Most of them, at least. Thankfully, the small group in town here seemed to have split off from the main force, so they aren't getting anything in the way of support. Uh, can I, is there a doctor time. around Let's here? Never mind, I don't have any Sir. more questions. Uh, hello. Got business here. 
I mean, yeah, kinda. Well, you weren't a whole lot of help, dude. You're useless. Enter the divide. Is this a DLC one? I think it is. They went that away. Inquire about your delivery assignment with the administrator of the Mojave Express in Prem. That seems like what we need to be doing. Other one seems like a DLC quest, which I do want to do. Try sleeping in a bed. Do you think that'll heal me? I'll help with my leg. Hmm. What's up here? Hey, what's up, buddy? It's been a long tour. All I can think about now is going back home. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. What is up with all of you people in mines? I just want to go back to freaking, uh, Good Springs. Yes. I know where our doctor is here. Ugh. I'm wobbling back. I'm wobbling back, doc. I'm gonna sleep at your place, too. I, uh, my eyes, are, they're heavy. Sir? Doc? Oh, there you are. How are you holding up? Not good. Don't you see I'm bleeding everywhere? I'm hurt. It don't look like nothing too serious. Are you Maybe serious? You up. Okay, fix me. Okay, hold still. <sighs> Thanks. Alright, uh, is this your bed? Can I have, do you have a bed for me? That's the real question here, doc. Where, where do I get to sleep? Aha. Can't sleep in an owned bed, fine. All right, let's go back. Let's go back to the prim area. This seems like the scary side. Is that a powder ganger? Are you a powder ganger, sir? Oh, yep, you are, you are, you are. I'm running, I'm leaving, I'm leaving, don't worry. Escaped convict. Oh God, more explosives. I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Don't worry, I'm out of here. Goodbye. How do I get out? Get me out of here. Oh God, that did not go well. There's a bed in the Good Springs gas station. That's the way to go. I did not. 
Okay, don't transport me to Prim. Let me just go. All right, Good Springs Gas Station. That's that's the play then. I, whenever I go fast travel to Prim, I didn't want it to bring me to the bad side of Prim. Aha. Sleep for seven hours. <clears throat> Maybe more tired or more thirsty, unfortunately. There we go. Okay, don't take me right to Prim. How about I go right here? All right, we run. Yeah, I wish the NTR would do something like sludge, I like that. Let's see if there's anyone else I can talk to here at NCR camp to kind of help me out. I guess we can just bypass it and try to sneak on through. We have our job. We have our task to talk to somebody in there. It's nighttime. We can sneak in. Hmm. Stick to the side. Let me go talk to the guy, the main poncho here. See if he's got anything to report. I don't think that's much of a hot take. They are incredibly useless. Yeah. What are you doing out here? Okay, he, he is useless. He's got nothing for me. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> yeah, they are incredibly useless. I can try to sneak in. <clears throat> Maybe my best bet here. about your delivery assignment with the administrator of the Mojave Express and Prim. Okay. I'm gonna move past these mines, you... God damn it! I didn't even get that close to it! Oh my god. That's the Mojave Express right there. That's all I gotta get to. Streets look empty. Moving. Talk to me, dude. Gotta roll. I'm gonna 
die. I guess sneaking is not my character's. <clears throat> it's not his no. forte. Hmm. It would have been easier if I didn't have my arm blown off. It's night time. Oh, what's up, dude? There has to be another way into this town, maybe. We can move around. Is this blocked off completely by the NCR? Yeah, these clowns have blocked this whole thing off. <clears throat> I'm gonna try to sneak in a different route. I want to sneak in. I gotta get in there, but I don't want. Can't fight my way through it. This is a problem. All right, let's move on. Move over this way. See what's going on. And just bypass it. Time being. My eyes peeled. It's up here. I need us more doctor's bags. Frag grenades? Wow, okay. Let's keep moving up. Like a oh. out of here, dog. Running around. Lonesome Road. to the divide. I don't really want to go that way. Lots of wild dogs over here, which I'm not a huge fan of. I'm pretty low on ammunition. There we go. Let's keep moving around. There's got to be another way to sneak into Prim. Or maybe get some more help. Oh my gosh, that looks like a big dog. Oh my gosh. in there? Not really. I could go directly to the strip. Yeah, that's an idea. You just went it right in and murdered everybody? That's a strategy. The problem is, my, my character is not the best gunfighter. A uh, bunch of ghouls. I am not screwing with that. around the back because that's where we need to be in that building
A little cafe down here. Let's explore that real fast. The more we get, the more stuff we get to, uh, you know, gear up, the better. Oh, uh, there's more of them. I think they're powder gangers. Oh, got his arm. Got him. Good. What's up, buddy? Turbo. Kind of like your outfit. I'll take your armor. Better than mine. Right now, it's not desirable. Hey, I don't like that. Oh, God. Be gone. Come here. No, don't leave. Yeah, you like that, huh? What in God's name? This terminal not work? Yeah, he like that. Ooh. Irvan shotgun. Okay, I'll take that. Merc troublemaker outfit. Beer. Can... Yeah, okay, I can't make any ammo yet right now. There we go. What's your character build? Are you going guns or melee focused? Yeah, so he's pretty much only going to be slinging pistols. I, I'm building him like an Italian mobster kind of character. So, you know, he'll beat people to death with random things, like a baseball bat. Um, unarmed, really, when he's in a more civilized area or a pistol. Yeah, I want to get this up to 25 medicine die but yeah his home is going to be like the Vegas strip like that's where he dwells you know I, I probably should have just gone unarmed because he, he is pretty good with unarmed probably better than actually using the bat but the problem is getting close is a problem Oh my gosh. He did not do very much damage. So maybe unarmed's not the way to go. Caribbean shotgun. Oh my god. Sopranos won it. No, he's pretty much, he's really stupid too. I was like, this guy's like Christopher from the Sopranos. Let me back in. Let me just uh, heal up before I go out there because she's not happy. So he's going to be like a drug addict. But yeah, no, it's a very Sopranos-esque build. Like, he has his hat. <laughs> I, I'm hoping I can get him a suit here soon. Um, okay. The problem is, like, early in the game, you just got to work with what... Oh, my God, lady. I was not expecting that. 
she ran up on me. Watch out. Oh, I don't have any ammo. Machete. Come here. Come over here. I'll jump you with this baseball bat. Yeah, how you like this Louisville slugger, huh? I'm here. I kind of like rocking the baseball bat. I mean, that was my other character idea. I was like, I just want to make a guy. This guy fits more Fallout 4 because like you have Fenway Park and stuff. But I was going to make it. I wanted to make a character that just beat the shit out of people with a baseball bat and wore like a baseball jersey everywhere. I think that'd be a lot of fun. And since Fallout 4 is more uh, looter shooter, it, it probably it worked pretty well in that game, I think. I like the lead pipe. Let's see, what's the lead pipe? What's a standard like mobster melee weapon, you know? Machete, yeah, that's kind of boring. The baseball bat's kind of good though knife I like the idea of rocking like a lead pipe if I can find that one something like that I think I can how do I do this oh there we go Oh, here's a lead pipe. Yeah, switchblade would be cool. Brass knuckles would be cool. Lead pipe. Oh my god, the lead pipe does a shitload of damage. That's what we're rocking with. It's kind of ugly. It's kind of an ugly lead pipe, but you know, I'll take it. Hey, how's it going there, big guy? Yeah, you think you're so tough? How you like this big lead pipe? Oh my god. I kind of like the bat more. I, th I think the bat has a better aesthetic. What do you guys think? Boat below. Bat or lead pipe? Like, I, I'd like the lead pipe if it wasn't rusty and gross. Cleaver. Mm. I'm kind of like in the Louisville slugger here. Angry Italian man. Mad about the New York Yankees. As far as I can tell, switchblade for hits, baseball bat for debt collection, brass knuckles for wise guys. Yeah, I, I like that. The weapon depends on the job. I have a present for you from the Powder Gangers. I hope you like dynamite. Oh, uh, oh shit. <laughs> it's a stick up. Oh, come here, you fuck. You gonna get a big t Oh my God. Um, wow. Oh, that ends Rick. Rick's story. Cut it out, will ya? Hey, I'll cut it out. Ugh. 
Oh my god, dude. I need to heal. Actually, I don't. It's just... Don't have any shotgun shells. No 9mm ammo. I have... That pipe kind of does good. Okay, let's go ahead and heal. The problem is I'm playing on such a hard difficulty that if I get hit, it's really just over. Let me eat a little bit. have my stem pa uh stem packs on on deck that's a quick save freaking powder gangers if that was just a random encounter or if they're gonna come after me again and come up this way you'll pay for what you did to the powder gangers oh hello you'll pay for what you did I, to the powder I heard gangers. you the first time big guy you'll pay for what you I'll did pay. to the powder gangers okay Over here. come here bats come on Where are you? I didn't realize this varmint rifle is five five six. Oh my it, yeah, two of us can play this game, bud. Bye. There we go. Yeah, a Tommy gun would be cool. Straight razor? Take a look at that. <laughs> How much damage does this do? I mean, it's pretty fast hitting. 19. I'm kind of digging the pipe, though. I'm going to be honest with folks. Or the bat. <sighs> yeah, let's go. Let's rock the straight razor for a second. See how we fare with it. spotted oh hey we got a safe Let me 
grab a shotgun. Oh, it was 10. I guess it wasn't a 12 gauge. What's in here, you fucking coin? Oh, God. I guess I got him. Me. I need to. Okay, and my stem packs seem to be a different keybind. Like zero. There we go, eight. Tire iron. A wrench. I kinda, I thought this is where I needed to go. Oh yeah, I need to just get in here. Try to fix it. Some servos and gyroscopes need to be recalibrated and replaced, but it looks so the robot can repair it 65 or higher. I cannot do it. Leave it alone. I'll be Dropbox. Programmers digest fixing things. Let's see if I can do fixing things. Try to fix it. Yeah, I can't. A lot of nothing in here. I played, I streamed Stalker a little bit a while ago, but yeah, that is something I'd want to play. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink your plans. Town's gone to hell. <laughs> I appreciate the honesty. Who are you? Johnson Nash is my name. Husband to Ruby Nash. Lived in Prim going on eight years now, thick and thin. I'm a trader primarily, for what it's worth with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. Um, I'm a courier with well, the Mojave I don't Express. Got any work right now, sorry to say. I lost the package I'll I was tell supposed you to deliver. I can. If you have a delivery order, you can show me. Yeah, I do oh, actually. So you're talking about one of them packages. That job had strange written all over it, but we couldn't turn down the caps. Hmm. Well, it's strange about it. That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Mm. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's where you came in. Some men stole my package, a man in a checkered suit and some thugs. Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. One of those men shot me. I needed to know the best way to get well, to him. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Beagle. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on them, and he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they were going. All right. Goodbye. Don't go getting yourself shot. I'll try. Um, when did I stream it? It was a while ago. 
I didn't play too much of it. I need to play that more though. Let me go ahead and save. This is probably going to do it for me. It's getting a little late. This is fun. All right, let's see. There's anyone to raid. Nope, not really. All right, gamers. It's real. It's fun. Uh, I'm probably not going to do an NCR playthrough or a Caesar one. I'm thinking uh, I'll side with Mr. House. All right, gamers. It's been real. It's been fun. I'll see you all on the next one. Thanks for tuning in. I will.